Leaders in the North County meeting to discuss the future of the Lawson Rail Project. That is a proposal to move the train tracks off the Del Mar Bluffs due to all the erosion and safety concerns. Yeah, but some of the proposed changes are getting some pushback from the people who live in that area. Our Delaney White joins us from Del Mar with more. Well, it's unusual for the board to meet in July, but they were surprised last month to find out that their property is under consideration with Sandag to have train tracks moved through the area. They met today to discuss potential impacts. At a meeting Monday, the 22nd District Agricultural Association Board of Directors, who own and operate the Del Mar Fairgrounds, discussed Sandag's notice of preparation of the draft environmental impact report for the rail realignment project. The project would move the train tracks off the Del Mar Bluffs and potentially on to the Del Mar Fairgrounds. What happens to the beloved San Diego County Fair, to horse racing, to music festivals? to this community gathering place. The board is discussing multiple alternatives, showing a map of one option that would require a cut and cover tunnel, arguing it would cause major disruptions and have a spillover effect on other activities at the fairgrounds. The board says this is the least developed alternative. Digging a tunnel through Solana Beach as proposed through alternative A would paralyze our downtown area. At the meeting, questions were raised about the location and cost of the project and how the 22nd DA might need to be compensated for the land and business complications. The board unanimously said that they oppose alternative A. This would be existential for us, that we need to reconsider some, some other issues as well, including the uh, affordable housing uh, discussions with the city of Del Mar. Earlier this year, the board asked that the district oppose any placement of the tracks that had a negative impact on their operational needs, warning that the site might not be able to support affordable housing if the city plans to run train tracks through district property. This would really have is such a major impact on our operations that could ultimately end our operations. The board says the city of Del Mar has not yet taken a stance, but they are expected to meet tomorrow to discuss the environmental impacts of the project. However, they aren't expected to make a final decision about this process until 2026. Reporting from Del Mar, Delaney White, Fox 5 News. All right, we'll continue to follow that process.